Bale. And today we are at Comfort Gardens near Nuki Sweet Waters. Yes, it's Sweet Waters. And I'm going to be showing you some of the accommodation and some of the amazing things you can do here. So let's get into it. Don't mind my hair in the previous clip. I was really tired by that point. But this is the reception area. This is where you'll be received if you're coming to check in. And it's really warm. The staff are really professional. The artwork was really, really, really cute. This is the dining area, the indoor dining area, and a bar area as well. And this is the view of the whole hotel grounds from the entrance. It's pretty, pretty big. Don't let the, the video fool you. It's bigger than it looks. I know. So this is part of the residential block, which is where they have their room, some of their standard rooms rather. And I like the fact that outside each room you have your own light and you can control how much light you want in and outside your room, which is such a win for me and people sleep lightly. These are their rooms. The rooms are really spacious, they're really big, coffee, hot water included with a view of all Pegeta entrance. Next, we went to the grounds. The grounds are where they hold functions. So if you have a wedding or if you have a team building, you can hire out the grounds. It fits about 100 people plus. And also when they have events like Easter or Christmas, they manage to use the grounds for outdoor settings and things like those, you know what I'm saying. The entrance to the grounds has a groom and a bride and a bridesmaid and a groomsman, I think. I was truly impressed by the amount of space in the grounds and I thought it would be a good place if you're hosting an outdoor event or if you just want to sit somewhere else with your kids and have a space for them to run around and play. In the middle of the grounds is a little island which they have where you can see the grounds all through really good for a wedding because you can have your altar thing there and the guests can sit all around facing you dope of course i'm always looking for a playground and i thought this was fantastic for people with kids you know what's up of course i had to entertain my daughter a little bit she seemed to enjoy it but the rain cut us short a little bit next we went to the castle the castle houses the conference center and it also houses the honeymoon suite the conference center ground level has a networking space which is open for you to come and network and kind of gives a bit of an informal vibe i love this chairs and the first floor is where the conference center is it's pretty big it's pretty spacious as well. The stairs were like those winding stairs, which gives it a beautiful feeling, but also a good exercise. And this is the conference space, like I said, pretty big. Next, we went to see the honeymoon suite, which is on the upper level on its own. It gives a feeling of absolute intimacy if you're coming for your honeymoon. And there is the living area. Of the honeymoon suite tv coffee everything you need and the main bedroom which has a beautiful massage bed the bed has speakers pop-up tv and the room has its own balcony we wound up our day by the pool hoping to have lunch there but the rain decided to plan our day for us so we ended up just having our lunch in the indoor restaurant but i still really loved the vibes from here wish we could have eaten here and to top it all off a beautiful amazing lunch the food was so good that chicken was stopped here and that is my mini review